you videotaping me? I am. Is that okay? Yeah, I just didn't know that was happening. <laughs> Um, you're one of the most powerful women in television with three shows now going to be simultaneously on the air. How does that feel for you? Um, a little bit weird, a little bit strange and, and fairly surreal, um, but exciting. I mean, I feel really proud that the shows have been doing well and that this scandal's going to get a chance and we're going to see what's going to happen. It's exciting. Scandal. I fell in love with it. I've watched both of all three episodes twice now. Mm -hmm. Where are you going with that crazy show? <laughs> Um, it's been exciting because I feel like that story, that show is a, it's sort of a, like it starts with this ball that's rolling downhill that just gets bigger and bigger and bigger and starts rolling faster and faster and faster until in the end, you know, it's almost running you over. It's exciting. It feels like a masquerade, like each and every single one of the characters is wearing a fancy mask and we're slowly ripping them off and finding somebody else underneath. Yes, I think that that's a really good way of looking at it. How did you come up with such an amazing concept? <laughs> You know, it's based on a real person whose uh -huh. name is Judy Smith, who's a professional fixer. But really, it was just about, you know, what happens when you're when you're very much in charge and how everybody you know has secrets. Awesome. Okay, about private practice. This show has gone through the emotional ringer, and just when you think you can't go any deeper, you find another way to peel it back a little bit further. Yeah. Do you think it's time to let these people sit on an island beach for an episode? Maybe when this season's over, they might need to sit on a beach and relax because right now it's it's pretty it's, it's going to get pretty hard. Things are going to get pretty tough for the characters around private practice. But there's also going to be really light, lovely moments and things that feel well deserved. Yeah. yeah. What about grades? That doesn't go quite as dark as uh, private practice, but it definitely feels like it takes some dark turns between the seasons. It does take some dark turns, and I can't guarantee that it won't take some dark turns before we're done this year. Okay. One last question. You take the most amazing risks with some fan favorite characters. Do you ever like have moments? about killing off favorites like that? Well, yeah. I mean, the problem is that I love everybody and don't want to, you know, kill anybody off, but there are, there is something to the idea that you're trying to do what's best for the show and you're trying to tell story. And to me, I always go, what's the most painful story? What's the hardest story? Like, if we're going to do something funny, what's the funniest way to go? If we're doing something sad, what's the most tear-jerkery way to go? Like, I always try to go there and sort of go past and further. So sometimes that means that people have to die.